Hello guys, welcome to Tech Covery IT Solutions and in today's video I'm going to show you how to recover uh, your lost data from your hard disk or from any USB drive or anything, uh, any drive you have, you can recover data through this process. So first of all, uh, let me tell you that the website I'm going to use uh, is completely secure. Uh, even if I ask you to turn off your uh, Windows Defender for some time, uh, that's completely okay. It's not uh, dangerous for your computer. So uh, just follow the steps and it will be helpful. So guys, you have to open uh, um, a browser, any browser you guys are using. I have two options, Microsoft Edge and Google Chrome. I'll go for Google Chrome and I have to type in my software mysoftwarefree.com uh, even you guys uh, have no need of typing it you can find the link to this website in the description of this video and now when you are here on this website you have to click on these three lines and it will give you a lot of options like a lot of software you can use the one we uh, are intended to use for this video is the data recovery so it will be in data recovery section now I have uh, three options here I can use any of these uh, software but the one uh, I'm recommending and I'm gonna use it in this video is this one is uh, US data so guys again when you are clicking on it it might go to the advertisement but you have to click like you know one time if it goes to the advertisement close it and come back and click it again now when you get this screen this is the actual screen of the software now we have to download this file but again when i'm clicking on it it might go to the advertisement section but no worries come back and click it click it uh, again and now it's coming up with the actual link Okay, so if it asks to accept cookies, go for it, accept it and start downloading. Now, this will take time because the file is big and when it's done, I'll be back. So guys, it's downloading, it's 32 MBs, but uh, it will depend on the speed of the internet you're using. Uh, if uh, you have good speed, it might take a, a short time. If uh, your speed is not good, it, it might take longer. So I'm using Wi-Fi and my signals are weak so maybe that's why it's taking uh, time. Again it depends on the speed of your internet. So we'll wait for it and I'll be back when it's done. So the file is here in the download folder uh, but uh, you can see it's a WinRAR file so we have to unzip it. Uh, in order to unzip it we need um, this uh, WinRAR application to be installed on our computers. So you can find a link in the description of this video uh, how to install WinRAR. So install this, pause this video and when it's done come back now right click on it and uh, extract files. Extract it uh, on the desktop. Okay, and now it's asking me the password. So the password uh, you guys can also find in the description of this video or you can also find it here in the uh, details of this link right down in the in This website so copy it and paste it when it's done. Okay, now this file is extracted Yeah, it's right here so I just want to make it clear for you guys. Now you guys have to turn off your internet. No internet. Now go open that. Softwares. So you have to click on uh, DRW. Which is the application file. Which is going to install the application for us. And OK. But please don't uh, forget to uh, turn off your Wi-Fi or internet you are using so click next accept confirm next next install install 
now it's going to install the application it's going to take that long so once the installation is done uh, now we don't need to uh, run the application right now so you have to unclick these two options just be careful don't finish it without unclicking it otherwise it will open the application and then the activation process will not work so when these are unchecked click finish now I close it and now we have to go to the website or you can also find the activation key in the description of the video and we have to run the application okay before that you do go here and copy this file and go to C and after going in there go to program file and go to the folder of this application and go to the recovery wizard and now we have to paste that file in here it's already exists but we have to replace it yes continue now this file is replaced now uh, i have to go and grab this key so you guys can take it uh, from the description of the video as well copy it and go in here and go run the application now but make sure the internet is off once the application is launched we have to click on activate go activate it it's activated successfully yahoo we're good you have a free uh, application for data recovery so now the thing is I can recover any of these uh, drives but uh, these are my local drives so I don't want to touch it uh, I will insert a USB or a, a hard drive external hard drive and I'll show you guys how to do it now guys I have a USB so I have to insert it when I insert the USB you can see it's loading the information because the uh, uh, extra drive is added as you can see it's detected now so or maybe this drive this USB is bad so we will wait for it because it's just scanning so when it stops scanning it will come up with the result and it will um, pick the USB as a drive yeah now you can see I have uh, this USB drive now if I uh, click on this and go start scanning yeah it just starts scanning the USB uh, the USB has a Linux bootable device like a Linux operating system I made it bootable for Linux so you can see it's just scanning and I just already uh, formatted the USB so physically there is nothing in the USB but uh, the scanner application is reading the data so now if you want to recover any folder first of all you have to wait for the scanning this scanning time will be like you know once once the scanning is done you can uh, uh, download or recover uh, all your data all together or you can uh, down, recover specific folders as well now when you click on these folders let's say I want to recover these and click on recover so it's just recommended that uh, let's uh, scanning to be completed but I'm like no okay I just need that folders so go to PC and uh, paste it on desktop okay now you can see it just recovered the data if I can go to my desktop okay 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 okay, okay cancel okay this is the recovered data so you can see the deep scan result and these are the last partition it recovered thank you so much for watching this video please follow the steps uh, carefully if uh, it didn't help once go to uh, uninstall the application completely go to C folder and go to C and go to program files and delete this folder as well and reinstall it again and then do the same procedure and it will work 100% thank you so much for watching this video and if it helps please like the video and subscribe to my channel bye